Well, first off, I'm going to start this video off by saying that, you know, I'm pretty happy to be a Ravens fan right now. I'm, I'm very happy. The amount of resilience this team has shown, not only in this game, but all year is amazing. There's simply zero, zero quit in this team. And this team will fight until the very, very end, which shows character. The Ravens coming into this game were down nine starters to either injuries or COVID and lost two more during the game. And that's excluding season ending injuries. We have had a total of 35 or so injuries this year. And a lot of them have been key players being out for, year, for the year. And... The Ravens are still in a position to make the playoffs, still tied first in the AFC North, which we will look to claim it back next week against the Bengals. Hopefully Lamar is, is playing and we and what we do, we put up a show. And yeah, man, with Lamar playing. It should be a, uh, it should be a treat. It should be a treat. L Lamar looking to have a bounce back game against a divisional divisional rival, Bengals, a team he's performed against very very well in his career. It it, it just should be a game, and and I'm I'm feeling a very very good game for Lamar next week. I'm feeling a very very good game. Uh, but aside from the point, aside from the point here. Uh, the Ravens have fight in them. The Ravens show do not give up. It it does not matter who they play. We have lost by one point against the best team in, in football in the Green Bay Packers. So this is good news right there. Uh, but yeah, let's talk about the game a bit. Offensively, first off, Mark Andrews. He's the first thing you have to bring up on offense. He's the first thing you have to bring up on offense. He was amazing. Mark Andrews completely carried, made the job way, way easier for for Tyler Huntley, just like he does for for Lamar, you know. So uh, he's he's on his way for to a second Pro Bowl appearance. Top three tight end, best tight end this year. And also, fun fact, fun fact. Uh, Mark Andrews is now the first tight end in franchise history to record at least a thousand yards in a season a Season and is only the second player ever That the Ravens have actually drafted to record a thousand receiving yards Mark Andrews as well is two catches away from breaking Dennis Pitta's record for the most catches by a tight end in a season in franchise history as well as having the second most catches in a single season in franchise history. R reminder, we still have three games left. So, Mark Andrews is going to break it. He's going to break these records. He's going to break these uh, franchise records. So, this is beautiful from Mark Andrews. So, continuing on the offense... It, it, it's 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 again a good game by Huntley. Good game by Huntley. You know, all right. Uh, you know, he didn't back down from the moment and played hard to try and 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 get us to a win. Uh, and by the way, uh, Lamar's still gonna be our starter. Lamar's still miles better. And it, it cannot be, I do not care if Huntley has given the best QB play we've had for the past three weeks. No, it's, it's not how it works. So that's, that, that's pretty much it. I mean, you can praise Huntley. You can praise Huntley without bringing another guy down, okay? You can comp, there's a way to compliment Tyler Huntley without ripping Lamar uh, Lamar apart. Just a reminder to that. 
Lamar's our starter. Lamar's our guy. He's going to get paid. Huntley, great backup. He's going to, you know, he, he might be a backup for another team. Or he's going to stay with us, be a great backup. When Lamar's down, we're going to be in good hands. So that's pretty much it. And I think Huntley would love to stay here. He's a good friend of Lamar as well. Uh, offensive line, Villanueva still sucks. Uh, ben Cleveland was good. He should have been starting the entire time. But apparently we just don't start guys. You know, we just don't start rookies a lot. So that's pretty much it. But from the Chargers game, uh, I already knew Ben Cleveland, Cleveland should have been the starter, the permanent left the guard starter for the Ravens. Uh, David Sharp, who came in after Tyree Phillips got, got hurt, uh, he's been good. He's been actually good. Uh, and maybe our best tackle play all year? Because I, I don't I don't think... Honestly, uh, when we elevated him, I did not know anything about this guy at all. But I said... How much worse can he be than how much can how much worse can he be than Alejandro Villanueva? He's been better, <laughs> uh, and Villanueva, Villanueva still sucks. So yeah, that's that's pretty much it. So uh, running back wise, Latavius Murray had a had his best game, I, I can say. I mean he's he's been he's been very very bad since. Uh, since since we got him for sure but yeah he's best game right here uh i'm gonna talk about the two-point conversion i'm gonna talk about john harbaugh and uh you know and, and that two-point call i think it was kind of i think it was a worst i think it was a worse decision this time than last time against the steelers like, it, I really don't, I really don't get it. I really don't get why. I really don't get why you just go for it. Uh, it hasn't worked at all. Uh, but, for God's sakes, for God's sakes, for God's sakes. Uh, just, you, you just tell, you probably told Huntley to throw it to Andrews. Have that read. Automatic read. I know Andrews has been lighting it up all game, but you'd think teams would would adjust against that. Uh, but yeah, man, uh, you're you're a phenomenal coach. You're a phenomenal coach, but you just cannot do that. You really cannot do that. But you know, Madden Ultimate Team managers are, are gonna say that you suck. Uh, but no, and and for sure the the fire hardball crowd is gonna come out and say, oh, fire him. Uh, no, you are on battery acid. We will not fire John Harbaugh at all. Uh, like man, if you think he should be fired, you do not have the slightest uh, the slightest understanding of how sports are coached and played. Uh. I think Harbaugh, I think Harbaugh's the reason why we're like that. We are in this position, eight and six. The amount of injuries, uh, our secondary utterly decimated. Running backs, offensive line decimated. Every other position group decimated. Just a crazy amount of injuries that is just not, not normal at all. Uh, he's the primary reason the Ravens haven't plummeted off the face of the year of the earth, despite all the injuries and inconsistent play on both ends of the football. The Ravens are eight and six, and well within reach of the playoffs. Uh, the games we won, the kind of games we've won, shows re resilience, grit. Uh, you know, and again, we just have character, and Harbaugh is. A big part of that he's able to coach these guys into not giving up uh, 
you know. And also, the, the culture he's installed in the locker room. We cannot forget about that. It's it, it's a healthy culture and and you know healthy vibe in the uh, in the locker room Harbaugh has installed. So we cannot be be like that. And if you want to bring up stats, Harbaugh is 137 and, and 85 in, in regular season and 11 and 8 in postseason. And he has only one season under 500. And it's a season where we had a worse team. And we were hit by injuries left, right, and center. Almost as close as this season, but I think this season is worse than 2015 in terms of injuries. But thing is, we have a better roster than in 2015. So we we're, we're so this year we're able to overcome these injuries. So that's the difference here. Uh, he has also most road playoff wins for a coach in NFL history uh, and coach of the year. He has a coaching in year uh, under his belt. If you want to talk more stats, so whoever's saying to fire him or he's an idiot or he's an overrated coach, you're a dumbass. You are dumb. Watch football. Under try to understand how football works because you clearly do not know how it is coached, how sports are coached, sports in general. How sports in general are coached and played. So I'm just, I'm just telling you, we cannot fire him after everything he did. It's you know it it, it just. I mean, whoever's saying fire Harbaugh, you're a dumbass. Yes, it's a dumb decision. It is not very very good decision this time around. But that does not define him. It, it, it does not tell his entire resume. But yeah, uh, that's my pep talk. Hopefully you understood what I said. And uh, you Ravens fans or ultimate team managers stop barking like idiots. That's all for Harbaugh. Uh, lastly for the offense, Greg Roman. Uh, you still suck. You still blow. Uh, you shouldn't have been fired at... Uh, last week but okay you should have been fired a long time ago after what you uh, because of how bad you are you should be out of here the second our season ends you should be the hell out of Baltimore you should step the hell out of there your play calling is so pathetic you don't understand how to use any of the players on this team and I, and you are a hundred percent failing our offensive players, our offense, everybody on our offense, especially Lamar, Huntley when he's there, everybody. Your 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 scheming, your lack of attention to detail in your scheming, your lack of care. It, it doesn't look like you care. It is unprecedented the amount of dick you suck, bro. I, I, I'm going to tell you that straight up. But okay, it's just... Uh, what else? Play calls. The play calls are shit. You're, you're play, I'm going to say it again. Your play calling sucks. Huntley just had to improvise... Because you had called yet again such a predictable play call. And that anyone could identify just by watching a little bit of film on this team from the past from from any team you've been coordin you've coordinated for the past nine years now. Which is still pathetic. Just uh, on on the two point conversion, on two point conversion, th this play call is so bad. It might be the the most bozo play of all time. You, you have to be you have to be crowned the worst offensive coordinator of all time because of that play call. It is so pathetic. It is so pathetic. Just y y you are so bad. Just, okay, 
we decided to go for two. Okay, it, it, it wasn't the best decision. Of course not. It's up to you. It's it, it's up to you. Like I, I I don't know what to tell you, but it's up to you. Just have a good play call at least. At least have a good play call. Instead of just in, instead of what was that? What was that? Like. It, And, man, and, and then you have people who proceed to say, oh, yeah, it's all on Lamar. Oh, it's on, it's on your receivers. Your roster's not that good. This offense is good. Shut up. On paper, on paper, you have a top five quarterback, a wide receiver who's breaking out finally in his third year. You have a lot of speed. You have a top three tight end. You have, I mean, the running backs, they're not here this year. But even last year, you, you were failing them anyway. So that's pretty much it. Uh, but yeah, it's just at this point where we make that decision to go for two. It's up to you to make sure we put this, we put this team in the best position to finish this game off. And... And come out with a win as well, but you just again, it's it, it's the most predictable play call. It's another predictable play call, and and it's one that many teams has seen all at this point in the NFL. You have Huntley rolling out to his right, and you and Harbaugh probably told him to throw it to Andrews. Oh yeah, let's give it to Andrews. Hollywood was open, I think. Uh, but it, it was just straight up stupid. I'm just, I'm just so excited. This season is going to be a win. No matter how this season finishes, if you're fired, this season is a win. This season is just a win. It, 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 it's a big win if you're fired after this year. No matter what happens with this team. Because... First off, we have started to win less, I guess. But Lamar is still a winner, so that makes you look competent. Lamar has won an MVP under you, so you look competent as well. But now you're getting exposed. Now you're getting exposed. So I'm just saying. So, fire Greg Roman. Harbaugh, questionable decision to go for two defensively i'm gonna go i'm gonna be very very simple defensively uh again patrick queen had a great game he's been nine nine and day better at will he's you know pro bowl level pro, pro bowl level at, uh, at will linebacker matt abuke stepped up in a, a huge way with Kalias campbell missing and uh, he was Huge as well, a pass rusher and a run defender. Uh, you know, Rodgers is very good. Roger, Rodgers is very good. They didn't, our pass rushers still do a very good job at generating pressure. So that's a good news. Uh, secondary, you pretty much lost us this game. Robert Jackson, you should not even be back. I, I wouldn't be surprised if you're not back in the practice squad next week. You have been burned by any receiver. It's it, it's not even Devontae Adams. It's like you have Marquez Van Vanda Scantling, bro, freaking burning your ass, bro. Like, come on. He, he, like, he's good, but he's not Devontae Adams. He's not Devontae Adams. At least be watchable at corner. And and you, and you weren't even that. So, yeah, man. That's pretty much for the defense. Defense did not play at a high level. Secondary got torched, lost as a game. Uh, at some, we couldn't stop Aaron Jones at all either. I mean, Rodgers is just good, so that's why he looked like he was doing anything he wanted. But that's pretty much that. Uh, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Subscribe if you're new. The preview, I'm gonna try to get it as soon as possible. Hope you enjoyed. Uh, yeah, man, tell, tell me 
you can tell me what you think down below. And yeah, guys, see you guys in the next one. Hopefully, we beat the Bengals next week. And 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 I honestly, I honestly have us winning. I have us winning next week. You know, I have us getting our revenge. We are motivated. We're getting guys back. Lamar might come back. Lamar's gonna light it up. You know it.